What's up guys? So we are back down here at the shop. I got a little bit of time this afternoon. Not a whole lot of time. We're just gonna squeeze in what we can. Um, I've got my ring compressing tool for Summit. Um, I'm gonna try to put these pistons back in. The other day we got we gapped all the rings. Everything actually already looked good. We didn't have to gap any. Um, magically worked out. Sometimes it does, sometimes it don't. But I would you'd never know if you didn't pull it apart. So uh, we've checked everything and um, I'm gonna start putting these things in real carefully and I'll get them tightened up and hopefully we have enough time to torque them. So uh, stick around, I'm excited to have this thing going back together so hopefully we'll, uh... it's getting close. Hopefully we'll have this thing going and before too long. All right, so I don't really know a right way or a wrong way to do this, but I do know assembly lube is where it's at. So I'm gonna take assembly lube, put it all right here on this bearing. I've got my rings, my uh, top ring is pointed down, my lower ring is pointed up. All right, so I've got most of them in, but uh, I got in kind of a hurry and just kept on going. So we're gonna put these last couple in. So far, everything's going pretty smooth. But uh, like I said, just trying to get it done, knock it out. Forgot to turn the camera back on. So uh, got these last couple left and then uh, we'll be able to tighten them up. All right, so we are down to torquing these bolts. Um, I'm using my buddy Evan Roper's sweet torque wrench, still got it. So uh, I'm gonna torque this thing. It says 15 pounds on your first pass and then 85 degrees. So we are going to uh, torque her down and we're gonna hope we don't break nothing. For, uh, for everybody who doesn't know, 15 pounds, 15 foot pounds is not a lot. So be kind of careful. Um, but what we're gonna do now is we're gonna degree it. It's gotta go 85 degrees from here. So we'll put it on degree and we'll start going from there.
All right, so one thing that I noticed on this torque wrench, whenever it's, you know, 85 degrees or whatever, you don't really know the torque on it. And uh, this thing actually measures the torque in Newton meters. And uh, the, uh, the lowest that we had was like 61 Newton meters. And the highest that I had was like 65.3. So all reality, it's really close. Um, I don't know what a Newton meter is, but uh, they're pretty relatively the same. So I'm tickled with that. Um, it rotates really well. And so uh, Megan said that she's headed home with dinner. So that's a wrap for today. All right, we are closing her up. Next few days, we'll uh, we'll be really getting that bad boy together, and then it's time to uh, start yanking it apart. It will, in fact, still crank right now. So I know it's not a big deal to a lot of people, but it is going to be really hard for me to tear that thing apart. So uh, you know, it's been a uh, long time.